that I've been working for the album is part of my DNA. Uh, a lot of songs, I had the chance to compose it too, so to be part of the composition of the songs. So, so for me, it's a very, it's a very intimate album. Very cool. Well, you can expect to hear sounds like reggaeton on this album as well as sounding more mature. That's some cool stuff. That was a lot of entertainment. Oh, yeah. So I mean, Fire Festival really got me fired up. <laughs> Adam, I'm like you. Good job. No, it's so much that I actually went to the website to see how much the tickets are. Oh, and? And the first 100 tickets are already sold out. Okay. Um, there's $400, the 400 tickets, those are $799. Oh my goodness. Let me tell you, the prices are okay. going all the way up to $7,999. You guys. This is on the Fire Festival Posh website. And it's for sure going to happen. I mean, <laughs> you guys, I don't know. I remember when the first Fire Fest happened. I think I, w I was a freshman in college. And I remember seeing on social media all this stuff went to YouTube. I haven't even seen the official documentary, uh -huh. so y'all know good. what I'm going to be doing this afternoon. <laughs> <Yeah>. It's good. <laughs> it's I haven't good. come yeah. up to watch it. Now I'm going to have to to yeah. see what's going on. Yeah. It blows my mind, you guys. I Something's saw, fishy. Yeah, no, seriously. I saw it, and just to see everyone's account of what was happening behind the scenes, even the workers coming forward and speaking yes. about it. I mean, we saw that cheese, lettuce, and tomato sandwich. <laughs> No, it's hilarious. That's how bad it was. I know. I, I just would be so embarrassed if I was him to like just put this on all over again. Like what what is going on here? Yeah. I don't understand. And Jessica made a good point. Well he had a lot of time to think about it. Yeah, he <laughs> and did. he still went In that route. Yeah. Solitary confinement. Yeah. I almost feel though that the hype of the documentary mm -hmm. and saying part two, yeah. it's gonna get people to come and buy these Absolutely. tickets. Absolutely. Uh, Some people might be coming prepared, maybe bringing yeah. their own yeah. snacks or water to make sure that they can take care of yeah. themselves under Oh, goodness. Whatever circumstances occur, well, what celebrities I know that, will come? Though. Yeah, that's usually a thing too. People Adam's going to be there. <laughs> oh, now the tickets are going <laughs> to sell out, Jessica. <laughs> <laughs> we can't let it out. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm, hopefully it doesn't rain over there, storm, oh, fire festival it might. time. <laughs> fire I think festival. There was, yeah. <laughs> no, it was a, it was a, I think there was some high winds during that time too, where some of those the tents, tents fell down. were not doing good That's either. So yeah. True. Yeah. I don't have I the like forecast. That in, Adam. <laughs> you don't have that future forecast? I don't forecast? have that forecast. <laughs> maybe, Jessica? maybe whenever it happens, we'll have to do a special a weather segment on like That'd fire awesome. Where it's event. being held at. Exactly. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. We'll have to get that figured out. <laughs> for now though, for your forecast, we are seeing a little bit of rain out there. So, you know, you might've woken up to the sound of that. Uh, we're also starting to see some heavier stuff come on shore, at least in Cameron County. We're not looking to see anything crazy. Crazy, but a couple of storms are definitely possible. Temperatures in the 70s this morning. This is definitely typical. We're just not used to waking up to the rain. So with that being said, make sure you bring a rain jacket. Make sure you bring an umbrella for the rest 